An unmanned combat aerial vehicle or UCAV is a combat drone that carries aircraft ordnance such as missiles, ATGMs, and or bombs in hard points for drone strikes and is used for intelligence, surveillance, target acquisition, and reconnaissance. These drones are typically controlled by humans in real time with varying degrees of autonomy. Many countries have adopted one or more types of UAVs for surveillance and communication, and some have combat-capable drones. Most aerial missions today can be performed by drones whether using air-to-ground missiles, laser-guided bombs, or even experimental air-to-air -air capability, raising the question of how long manned military jets will last before becoming a historical curiosity. In this video, we will concentrate only on the 10 combat capability drones that are active and currently under development. Number 10. MQ-9 Reaper The MQ-9 Reaper is the first hunter-killer UAV designed for long-endurance, high-altitude surveillance. The MQ-9 is a larger, heavier, and more capable aircraft than the earlier General Atomics MQ-1 Predator. While it is not the most technologically advanced drone by today's standards, it is the most widely produced, adopted, and used. With a slew of modifications, a dozen operators, and millions of flight hours, Reaper has become the poster child of modern drone warfare, carrying entire armed conflicts and igniting far too many controversies to count. Number 9 is TAI Aksangur. The Turkish aerospace industry's Aksangur is an unmanned aerial vehicle built for the Turkish armed forces. It is the manufacturer's largest drone and payload capacity for mission-specific equipment based on existing technology from the TAI Anka series of drones. It is intended to be used for long-term monitoring. Aksangur is a medium-altitude, long-endurance UAV, and what pushes Aksangur above many similar designs is its impressive reported endurance of over 40 hours. It has an operational range of up to 6,500 km and a cruising speed of 250 km per hour. Number 8 is Winglung 2 Winglung 2 is a Chinese UAV product of the Chengdu industry intended for use as a surveillance, aerial reconnaissance, and precise strike platform. The export version of this Chinese drone has already proven itself in several Middle Eastern conflicts in the hands of the UAE, while Pakistan and Egypt has also purchased dozens of them. It can carry up to 200 kilograms of laser-guided bombs and is capable of air-to-air -air armament, according to the manufacturer. Its endurance is about 32 hours. Wing Lung 2 has a range of 4,000 km and can travel a maximum speed of 370 km per hour. Number 7 is EADS Barracuda. The EADS Barracuda is a jet-powered UAV intended for the role of aerial reconnaissance and combat. The aircraft is a joint venture between Germany and Spain. It is more of a combat aircraft than anything else designed to carry 300 kilograms of precision munitions in its internal bay, ready to be delivered at a moment's notice before an enemy could detect the intruder. Barracuda is little known after its maiden flight in 2006, and while the project may have been shelved, it was unquestionably the first European combat drone of its kind. Its enduring power is around 17 hours and can travel a maximum speed of over 1,000 km per hour. Up next on the list is Avenger. The Avenger, unlike the previous MQ-1 Predator and MQ-9 Reaper drones, is powered by a turbofan engine and features stealth features such as internal weapon storage and an S-shaped exhaust for reduced infrared and radar signatures. It can carry a staggering array of munitions, lift nearly three tons of them, and direct fire at the enemy using the electro-optical targeting system of the F-35 Lightning II. The Sea Avenger should be mentioned as well as it adds to the platform's ability to be based on an aircraft carrier. Number 5 is X-47 The Northrop Grumman X-47B is a demonstration unmanned combat aerial vehicle designed for aircraft carrier-based operations. The X-47 deserves to be mentioned because of its impressive features and capabilities, but it was only a proof-of-concept program that has since been discontinued. Nonetheless, all evidence points to the United States Air Force adopting some kind of more advanced successor, possibly supersonic and combat-capable. There isn't much known about them. The RQ-180 is most likely the spiritual successor to the S-47 and the future X-47 series will likely have a range of 3,900 km at subsonic speed. 
Number four is Hongdu GJ11 Sharp Sword. A little is known about this Chinese stealth UAV till date. It took to the skies for the first time in 2013, and China has boasted about the drone's deep penetration capability, implying a large internal weapon bay and ability to deliver laser-guided munitions, which would likely result in performance comparable to other stealth drones of this type. It is powered by a single turbofan engine and has a 14-meter wingspan with an internal weapons bay and a stealthy propelling nozzle. The precise mission assigned to the Sharp Sword is unknown at this time, but possible missions include aerial reconnaissance and eventually combat missions. Number 3 is Sukhoi Akotnik B. Sukhoi S-70 Akotnik B, meaning Hunter B, is a Russian stealth heavy unmanned combat aerial vehicle. It has been under development since at least 2011 jointly by Mikoyan and Sukhoi Company as a sixth-generation aircraft project. It is likely to join military service by 2025. It can carry almost 3 tons of armament and has an operational range of 6,000 kilometers. Akotnik is intended to work in tandem with the Su-57 5th generation jet fighter and will likely travel a maximum speed of 1,000 km per hour. Up next at number 2 is BAE Systems Neuron. The Dassault Neuron is an experimental UCAV of the French company Dassault Aviation. Countries involved in this project include France, Greece, Italy, Spain, Sweden, and Switzerland. The design goal is to create a stealthy autonomous UAV that can function in medium to high threat combat zones, and its intended purpose was to explore a prospect of delivering up to two tons of explosive in high threat zones and defend themselves from both ground-based and aerial adversaries. Neuron's design has an emphasis on functioning in autonomous cooperation with manned aircraft as a loyal wingman. Number 1 on the list is XQ-58A Valkyrie. Valkyrie is the next logical step in the evolution of UAVs. Designed to serve as a support to the fighter jets relying on either direct control of its manned peers or onboard AI, it can scout the battlefield, engage the enemy, and sacrifice itself to shield man aircraft. The most impressive part of this whole ordeal is the price as the drone is supposed to cost $2 million apiece on par with cruise missiles and almost nothing compared to actual fighter jets. Being almost as capable as manned fighters but cheap and easily replaceable allows an army to produce entire swarms of them, overwhelmingly any kind of enemy defense. While still in prototype testing stage, Valkyrie is expected to be put into mass production in 2021, defining a picture of future robot warfare. And that's it guys for today, we hope you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe and notification bell if you want to see more videos from the buzz. Thank you.